Hi classmates, so I'm going to do my eye am injection. I'm just going to show you my environment. There isn't anything around that could possibly give me the answers. So I am at my computer. I am checking Mr. Jonah's order. He has an order for 50 milligrams of dehydrochloride and it's going to be administered intramuscular. So now I'm going to actually pull my medication from the medication dispenser. I'm comparing it to the MAR. This is my second check. This is dehydrochloride, 50 milligrams for Mr. Jonah. And my calculation is going to be 50 divided by 1,000. That's going to give us 0 0.05 milliliters. And that is my second time checking it. I'm closing the medication dispensing machine. And I am now heading to um, Mr. Jonah's room. But before I head there, I want to notify you that I do have my 1cc syringe, my 25 gauge, 5 eighths needle, alcohol swab, and medication. I'm going to back this all up and we're ready to go. So I'm at my patient's room. I'm performing hand hygiene. Knock, knock. Hi, Mr. Jonah. My name is Morgan. I'm going to be a nurse for tonight. How are you? Good. I just have a medication here for you, an injection. But I just want to confirm on my computer before we get started. Can I have your name and date of birth? Okay, thank you. Can I see your armband? Okay, thank you. So, this is my third time checking the medication. I'm comparing it to the MAR. This is for Mr. Jonah Dipperman. He is receiving 50 milligrams of dehydrochloride and it's going to be administered intramuscularly. <coughs> Excuse me, intramuscular. Um, so that's my third time checking. So I checked it, performing hand hygiene again just for safe measures, putting on my gloves. Okay, Mr. Jonah, I have your shot ready. And I am going to inject it in your deltoid, okay? The way that I locate the deltoid, find a chromio process, go three fingers down, and it's gonna be right here in this V muscle, and you're go we're going to inject him right here, okay? And this will be a 90 degree injection. I'm gonna go ahead and clean his arm. My motions are moving outward. Just clean the patient's arm. Have another alcohol swab. Cleaning the medication. Okay, medication is clean. Now I'm going to open my syringe. Syringe is open. Open my needle. The needle is open, still in the boat. Everything is still in the packaging. Remove my syringe. Mr. Jonah, I would like to ask you, are you allergic to any medications? Okay. Thank you for clarifying. Just apply my appropriate size syringe with the needle. I'm gonna keep this on. I'm going to draw up 0 0.05 milliliters of air. Now, we are going to inject this into our medication. Now we're going to pull. And before we pull, I did inject the air back into the, the vial. And I'm just gonna pull a little bit more than 0.5, okay. Let's get all that air out. Okay, air bubble is out. So we are going to pinch the skin that's on the arm. We're going to inject it 90 degrees. We're going to aspirate first. 
No blood. Good. Now we're going to shoot in. Putting pressure on the skin. And I'm also capping my needle. I'm going to twist that off. Put that in the sharps. Check on my patient. Make sure my patient is fine. And I'm going to go back to my computer, document that I administered the medication. So we did have the right patient, right time, right dosage, right medication, and the correct route. So I'm going to document all of that into my computer. I'm going to place the call light back in his bed. I'm going to take off my gloves, tell him if he has any questions. I'm here to answer, and I will be back to check on him in a few minutes to check the injection site. If you're in any pain, if you are any in any pain, please let me know. I'm lifting my bed rails back up, and I also let the bed at the lowest setting. Walking out the room, performing hand hygiene, and the injection is done.